I'm Jeff Summers, and welcome back to another uh, not an Ask Jeff Anything, because nobody's asked me a question in a little while. Um, instead, I'm going to be talking about a series of blog posts that I started last week um, using the hashtag GetTheBlood. Um, these blog posts relate to my two novels coming out this year, Fixer and We Are Not Good People, in July and October, respectively. Um, and the posts are going to be discussing scars that I've acquired in my lifetime, um, because scars feature prominently in these two books and in the magic system that I invented for these two books. So I thought it would be interesting to talk about, you know, the things that mark us in life. Um, you know, scars, uh, like this one, this one, this one, this one, uh, and the scar on the back of my knee, um, which answers the question, what happens when you're 19 years old and you're away at college and you get a tick? Uh, and 27 of your drunkest and most incompetent friends attempt to administer first aid. Um, and I've gotten a few responses, so I thought I would uh, turn them into videos and post them here. Um, our first response comes from Chris Chapman, and Chris writes, From the I wasn't juggling chainsaws, but still ended up with an awesome scar file. I like that. Question. What do you get when you're told that you have an AVM, an arterial venous malformation, defined as a tangle of abnormal and poorly formed blood vessels, arteries, and veins in the brain, which at any time could lead to an aneurysm and kill you instantly? Answer, you get surgery. I was lucky, the procedure went off perfectly, and my hairline mostly covers the scar, which runs from eye level to the crown of my forehead. If I needed a reminder that I am mortal and scars aren't always the consequence of attempting something unwise, I have it now. Well, thanks for writing in, Chris. That is actually a fascinating story, and it does make me feel kind of like a jackass because every single one of my scars are, in fact, the result of me doing something incredibly unwise. Thanks again, Chris, for writing in. If you have a scar story you'd like to share with us, uh, please feel free to email me or text me or Facebook me or whatever the hell, and you know we'll turn it into a video as well. Um, until next time, I'm Jeff Summers, and as we learned here today, yes, I'm a jackass.